Is there something you could say about the standard model? So the four laws of physics that seems to work very well and uh, yet people are striving to do more, talking about unification, so on, why? What's wrong, what's broken about the standard model? Why, why does it need to be improved? I mean, the thing which gets most attention is, um, is, is gravity, that we have trouble. Um, so you wanna, in, you wanna, in some sense, integrate, integrate what we know about gra the gravitational force with, with it in, uh, and have a unified quantum field theory that has gravitational interactions also. So that's the big problem everybody talks about. Um, I mean, but, it, but it's also true that if you look at the standard model, it has these very, very deep, beautiful ideas, but there's certain aspects of it that are very, <laughs> that, that, that are, let's, let's just say that they're not beautiful. They're not, um, you have to, th to make the thing work, you have to throw in lot, lots and lots of extra parameters at various points. Um, and a lot of this has to do with the so-called, uh, you know, the so-called Higgs mechanism in the Higgs field, that if you look at the theory, it's everything is, if you forget about the Higgs field and what it needs to do, the rest of the theory is, um, is is very very constrained and has very very few free parameters. Really, a very small number. There's a very small number of parameters and a few integers which tell you what the theory is. To make this work as a theory of the real world, you need a, a Higgs field, and you need to it needs to do to do something. And once you introduce that Higgs field, all sorts of parameters um, make an appearance. So now we've got twenty or thirty or whatever. whatever parameters that are going to tell you what all the masses of things are and what's going to happen. So you've gone from a very tightly constrained thing with a couple parameters to uh, this this thing which the minute you put it in you had to add all this extra all these extra parameters to make things work. And so that it may be one argument as well that's just the way the world is and the fact that you don't find that aesthetically pleasing is just your problem or Maybe we live in a multiverse, and those numbers are just different in every universe. And, but it, but you know, another reasonable conjecture is just that well, this is just telling us that there's something we don't understand about what's going on in a deeper way, which would explain those numbers. And there's some kind of deeper idea about where the Higgs field comes from and what's going on, which we haven't figured out yet, and that that's that's what we should look for. But 